Yes, uh, how are you class 5? Today our uh, topic is called geometry whereby we shall look onto a subtopic called the area of triangles. How to find the area of triangles? A triangle is a figure like this, we have been seeing it since grade 1 but we will concentrate on only how to find its area. Finding the area of a triangle, we have to use the base, this uh, horizontal distance, and the height, the vertical distance. Look onto the two triangles here, number one and number two, both has base and the height. In finding the area of a triangle, we use a half times base times height. A half times base, the horizontal uh, distance times height, the vertical one. Or shortly, we say, Area meaning uh, A meaning area is equal to a half BH. Okay, the triangles we saw them since grade one, two, three, and four, but uh, this time round we're going to look onto the finding the area of a triangle. A triangle is a figure like this you can see here with the, the three sides. Uh, it has the, the height uh, and the base. You can see in the second, this is right angle triangle with also it has the height and the base. The base is being represented by letter B and the height is being represented by letter H. Finding the area, we use the formula which is stating that the area is equal to a half times base times height. Briefly, we say area is equal to a half BH. Let us look at some examples on how to find the area of a triangle. Example number one, we have a figure like this, a triangle, a right angle triangle with dimensions 6 as the height centimeters and the base as 8 centimeters. How can we find the area of it? So as I have seen above that the area is a half times base times height. So our height is 6 centimeters. Our base is 8 centimeters, so we're going to take a half times 6 centimeters times 8 centimeters, which is 6 times 8 is 48. Uh, so 48 over 2, which is simply 24 square centimeters, goes on for the area. Example number 2. We have a triangle with the dimensions height 6 centimeters and the base 9 centimeters. How can we get this area? We say the area is given by the formula, which is saying a half times base times height. Therefore, our height is six centimeters and our base is nine centimeters. So a half times six centimeters times nine centimeters. We take six times nine is 54 plus, divided by two, we get 27 centimeters square. So the area will be 27 square centimeters. Example number three. We have another triangle here with the dimensions 8 meters as the height and the base 10 meters. We have agreed that finding the area of a triangle, we have to use a formula which is saying area equals to a half times base times height. And therefore, let us see, put the dimensions into the formula. So the area will be a half times the base, which is 10 meters, times height 8 meters. By multiplying 8 and 10, we get 8, eh? isn't it? Now, 8 divided by 2, we get 40. Therefore, the area is 40 square meters. Example number 4. Here, we have a right angle triangle with dimensions 15 centimeters the height and 12 centimeters the base. As we have agreed in the, the above examples, that in finding the area of a triangle, we have to take a half times base times height, or a half bh. Let us put now our numbers into the format to get the area. So it's uh, simply a half times 12 centimeters <coughs> times 15 centimeters, which is uh, 15 times 12, which is 180. Now divided by 2, we get is 90. So the area is 90 square centimeters. Have we understood? Oh, yes, thank you so much. Now let's go to an exercise here. 
Uh, now, people, after we have seen all those four examples on how to find the area of a triangle, now it's your high time to answer the following exercise. Please, while you're doing it, make sure you abide and you follow our procedures on the, the above four examples. I hope we do the best. Thank you so much. May God bless you. We have uh, uh, an exercise of uh, finding the area of the following triangles. We have six, I mean, six questions here. Use what we have been discussing about to answer all these six questions. Thank you so much.